Versailles and Paris, they're inseparable. When Versailles arrived in Paris in 1924, he wanted to be a painter. He thought he was going to become a painter. Uh, but he never did much painting because he fell in love with the city and the life. And uh, of course, Paris was then the center of the art world. So it attracted all kinds of people who weren't from Paris. I mean, the, think of the Spanish painters who were there, uh, Picasso, Dali, uh, Miro. So there was a very rich, active, artistic community. But as Versailles pointed out, there's a wonderful radio interview with him in 1964, where he's talking about Montparnasse and his friends there, and the, the, the poet and artist Henri Michaud and his Hungarian friends and so forth. And then all of a sudden he gets very excited and he says, but you have to understand it wasn't just artists. There were adventurers and crooks and thugs, and these were the people that really fascinated me. He arrived in 24 and he didn't really start photog photographing in earnest until 1930 and in those six years this is when he got really involved with all of both the sophisticated artists but also all the low life of Paris.